Hey guys, and welcome back to Steam Nation. Steam power plays an important role in society. Water heated to a gaseous state creates an invisible energy with countless possibilities used around the world. Today we're taking a closer look at one of the many types of industrial boilers behind this process, the fire tube boiler. Fire tube boilers are one of the most commonly used type of boiler in modern day plant operations. With a wide variety of sizes from 15 up to 2,000 plus horsepower, a relatively small footprint with regards to its capabilities. The fire tube boiler is an excellent choice for processes where lower capacities and pressures, less than 250 PSI, are required. This design is a reliable choice for plants where the steam demands remain fairly steady and predictable during normal operations. The name fire tube says it all. The fire created from combustion is channeled through the furnace and on through the sections of tubes within the vessel, all of which are surrounded by the water being heated to create steam. At each end of the boiler, the flue gas takes a turn and creates what is known as a pass. This pass of a fire tube boiler is an often referenced design characteristic that simply put, refers to the number of times the hot gas from the burner passes through and creates the opportunity for heat transfer. Scotch Marine or Scotch Boiler is an often referenced to name as the compact design originates from boilers used in ships. The design of the fire tube boiler makes cleaning, maintenance, and even major repair work possible in place, even for some of the tightest spaces, while most of the time not even moving the boiler, its surrounding equipment, or piping. The fire tube boiler is an industrial workhorse known around the world. Its basic design has been used for over a hundred years and is certain to be around providing steam for plants for many more years to come. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to our channel for more great videos from Steam Nation.